Hello, my sparklies. How you doing? Super great. Fantastic. Amazing, I hope. So, I come to you from the glam closet, interrupting my glam time. As you can see, I'm changing my show. But I was thinking, as per usual, and I was thinking about how I used to use like CBD oil and essential oils and just a whole lot of natural things to just unwind and relax and be able to sleep after work because I was doing like night shift and stuff. And then I realized one day that I'm an adult. Like <laughs> if I want to drink, if I want to smoke, if I want to have sex, I can. I can do whatever I want because I'm an adult. And so then that helped solve, you know, a problem I was having, like not being able to sleep and unwind after work or whatever. And, but then that was making me think, that was making me have the realization that maybe you guys need help coming to the realization to solve your own problems because you need to be your own problem solvers. That's a, that's a problem within itself, but more, actually that's more like a tension you need to manage because then you forget that you can solve your own problems and then you start looking for outside solutions when really you can always solve it within yourself, but never mind none of that. Let me tell you. So you guys, you guys have so much more freedom than you could ever think. Nobody, you don't have to wait. You don't have to wait till marriage to have sex. There's so many, there's so many like just messed up rules that you are trying to live by to be perfect when there was never meant to be perfection in this realm. And you're trying to achieve something that is quite literally impossible because it's, it doesn't exist in this realm. But whatever, whatever. Let's just say you have all these problems and you have to find a solution. So what are you going to do? Let me tell you what you're going to do. Let's say that you're like, okay, let me give you a problem, something. You did something really bad. You, okay, so you, you, <laughs> I can't even think of something. I can't even think of something. <laughs> it's like bad. And that's like, that's like fucked up. I mean, it's not, but it's like, guys, I just be vibing so high and so happy that I can't, I don't even have like negative thoughts to think of something bad. And that's crazy. But maybe I can tell you how to get there. I don't, I don't know like where to even start. Let's just say, okay, you did something awful, terrible. You make it up in your head, whatever this awful, terrible thing, this terrible, awful thing you did. <laughs> like from the hell. Okay. That's perfect. Let's say you did. Something terrible, awful, like many did in the help. What would you do to fix it? Okay, so, well, I'm not going to say Hilly deserved that because, I mean, she did. But, okay, you still, that's not nice. So, okay, you have to fix your terrible, awful. This is what you do to fix it. You have to go to rectify the situation in, in person or however you can physically in this realm. You need to go do that. And rectify it, fix it, say you're sorry, your apologies, all that stuff. Let's say that isn't possible. Like, this person don't want to talk to you, you don't want to deal with them, whatever. What does the Bible, the um, Quran, all these holy texts tell you to do? You give your burdens to the Lord. So all you have to do is literally pray it away. Just pray it away. You just say... You have to repent because you have to you have to atone for what you did. And there's no way to skip atonement. But the only way that you can like, I don't know, speed up your process or um help yourself is if you start healing. And when you start healing, you start to see the person and the person that you hurt and recognize the person in yourself. So when you're doing that and you're putting yourself in their shoes and then you feel everything you made them feel well that's because it's being sent back to you from the universe you cannot stop something being sent back to you because that's what you sent out but let's say that you put bad stuff out and you realize like oh that was so bad i didn't i didn't want to do that i didn't mean to do that you can't like undo that bad that you sent out but you can send out good so that good will come back to you so let's say you did your terrible awful or whatever and you're trying to fix it. And then you can't talk to that person. You can't like go fix it physically with them. All you have to do is pray for them. You pray for your, your enemies, your adversaries. You pray for the people that you hurt. And that is how you know that you are healed. Because you are recognizing them within you and you within them. 
And then you realize that you guys are one and that you're only hurting yourself by hurting someone else. So, yeah, that's all I really feel like talking about today. Do I feel like talking? No, I don't want to talk no more. So, yeah, I'm going to go back to doing some relaxing show changing glam stuff. And you're going to go work on, I don't know, whatever you were doing. Probably thinking about me. I mean, that's what people are usually doing. So, <laughs> you can go. Hopefully not think about me. Think about your problems and fixing them. But I mean, if I must, if I must run around your mind, I guess that's fine too. You can get a life. I'm sorry. That's rude. <laughs> okay. Bye.